just been stripping this camshaft carrier down for cleaning thought it was a good opportunity to explain the variable cam timing system on this engine. This is what's called the VarioCam Plus timing, which gives fully adjustable timing for the intake camshaft only. So this is the intake camshaft, this is the exhaust camshaft. They're both driven off the same chain, but the exhaust one, the timing of that is fixed, so no movement on that. Whereas for the intake, it is controlled. It's controlled using this actuator here. It uses the engine oil for the control and what happens is the oil is passed through one of these two ports depending on the system, depending on where the actuator is set to and that sends the oil through these two holes in here through into these two holes in the camshaft. The oil from this hole here passes straight through center of the camshaft so when that's in there like that, the oil from here passes straight through the center of the camshaft down to this end of the actuator and basically comes out in here through see these holes holes inside here comes out through here and what that does is it serves to push this spiral in this way so that's pushing the timing that way and the oil which goes through this hole here passes through here, through the holes, see the slots in here, and then goes through into these holes in this section here, and basically to the back of the spiral, to there pushing the spiral this way. And then when the unit is assembled like that, as the spiral moves backwards and forwards, it's basically rotating these two relative to each other. So it's all a low pressure system, just using the engine oil pressure. The position of the camshaft is picked up using this sensor here. So there's a sensor which goes in through the camshaft cover to give feedback to the engine control system. It's quite similar to the BMW Vanos system, although the ones I've worked on with that operate on both the intake and the exhaust, whereas obviously this is just on the intake. The cup engines that we use this um, head, they have fixed timing. The variable timing is basically used to give better road manners at low speed without compromising the high speed performance.